Hey everyone, it's me Kelly King from You Got Nails and today's nail tutorial is going to be song inspired nails and the song that inspired these is Carly Rae Jepsen's Call Me Maybe. Alright, I hope you guys like it. Begin your manicure with a light colored base. The first part of the design you will create is the phone. Use a dotting tool and black polish to create the two ends of the receiver. Next, use a small paintbrush or striping tool to connect your two dots. I did this step with a few coats so I could get the cleanest looking line. Here is what a finished receiver looks like. Now it's time to make the cord. You're going to draw a line from the edge of the phone and make a small loop in the line. It's okay if the line is light at first. You can always go back over it with another coat of black polish. Once you finish the cord on your thumb, it'll be time to make the cord on the rest of your fingers. Continue drawing small loops. I did mine with one line on one side and one line on the other. It's okay if your loops are uneven. This only adds to the fun of the look. Again, don't worry if your loops are too light at first. You can always go back over them with another coat of your black polish. Here's a close-up of a finished cord. You're going to make the base of the phone on your pinky. Start by making one diagonal line from the top two thirds of your nail down towards the bottom and a matching line on the other side. I made my lines light at first so I could go back and fix any mistakes I made. Connect your diagonal lines at the bottom and top and fill the shape in with black polish. Do a couple of coats because the entire shape does need to be black and you don't want any of your base to show through. To make it look like the foam would sit on your base, add two tiny lines at the very top. I chose to make my phone an old rotary style phone. You can do this by putting a white dot in the center of your phone base. Next, in the center of your white dot, add a silver dot. Then use either a dotting tool or the tip of your paintbrush to make tiny black dots. This will represent where the numbers would go. Here's a close-up of a finished phone base. Now it's time to make your speech bubble. Start by making a small triangle shape coming out of the bottom of your phone receiver. Make two curved lines from the edge of your thumb connecting back to this triangle. Fill in your speech bubble with white polish. Outline your speech bubble with a line of black polish. Now it's time to write call me inside of your speech bubble. To ensure that your hand stays steady, get into a position that you are very comfortable with. Make sure you use light coats of polish because you can always go back and make the letters darker. Here is a finished speech bubble. And that's it. You have completed the call me maybe manicure. Here's my right hand and here's my left. Don't forget to comment and tell me what you'd like to see. 